The president of the National Union of Road Transport Workers, Tajuddin Barua, has accused the immediate past president of the union for violating the union's constitution by aiding and abetting the installation of an illegal caretaker committee under the leadership of the former vice national president of the union. He also accused the former national president for sponsoring clandestine meetings in Kaduna and Abuja against the current leadership. Barua thereafter appealed to the Inspector General of Police, Kayode Betoku, and the Director General of the Department of State Services, TSS, to wade into the crisis in the union before it leads to breakdown of law and order. The former president of the National Union, he said that uh, uh, the voice today, he constructed some uh, committee that uh, they are going to see the advice of the union. And somebody gave him a letter that uh, either you choose a committee or build a Kazika. He has no the power. He doesn't have the power. The Council of Europe doesn't give the power. The so-called advisory committee that put there in the union, where they doesn't want to go, stated that he could be president, former president of the union, he could be secretary secretary of the union, former secretary of the union, former teacher of the union, which I am former teacher of the union. And he could be said present. And I don't know why he's not coming to the meeting. And people call him also. That you don't have the power to do that. I say, no, so no. Somebody has an interested party. What of him? And I, I, I and I want to I want to I want to remind the the DC DC uh IG monitoring. When he took his phone and called Najim that day, I said you are calling Najim. Najim is one causing problem in the union because they want to leave the seat. I'm therefore calling to the Inspector General of Police, IG, to do the needful. More especially the promise he made by the Nigerian Labour Congress. I'm also calling the Director General of the State Department. Uh, state uh, security service he is also aware we have made a lot of submission complaining to him and we had a meeting there where the other group refused to sign the peace and resolution we hope the law will take its course